More than 2,000 volcanoes have been discovered on the Earth. There are 523 volcanoes. And among the more than 500 volcanoes, 68 of them are in the deep sea. Some are erupting. Some may erupt again at any time. Go to general physics. Water puts out fire. How can Foshan erupt on the seabed? Why water can extinguish fire? Is the result of a combination of two factors. Oxygen isolation. Lower the temperature of combustibles. Neither factor holds true for submarine volcanoes. Lava erupted by volcano. Not in the conventional sense. Still molten rock. 6. According to scientists speculate, the temperature of the Earth's core is as high as 6,000 degrees. Delay melts at 900 to 1,200 degrees. Due to the constant motion of the Earth, when magma rises to the surface, water and gas dissolved in magma eventually start bubbling. Once started, the rate of magma activity will increase sharply. Final eruption. Volcano eruption disagree flames, relying on the thermal energy of the Earth's interior rather than chemical energy. Therefore, does not require oxygen supply. As for the second temperature problem, Seawater can indeed cool down rivers, but submarine volcanoes spew out due to high pressure. Seawater cannot take away the heat of so much magma, so the eruption of the volcano cannot be suppressed. Finally, it will still be cooled slowly under the action of seawater. Many sea islands. It is solidified magma, but at the same time as some submarine volcanoes erupted. Often accompanied by the spectacular sight of submarine fires. What is happening? It's not a real flame either. Or thermal radiation. All warm objects. It will be heat radiation. The higher the temperature. Radiated electromagnetic waves carry more energy. When magma is rapidly cooled by seawater, these high-temperature magma will emit a large number of electromagnetic waves. Looks like it's burning. 